diseases of the respiratory system. The leading causes of death around the world are diseases affecting the respiratory system. Respiratory diseases may be caused by smoking tobacco, by breathing in secondhand tobacco smoke, by infection, radon, asbestos, or other forms of air pollution. Here are the diseases of the respiratory system. Number 1. Asthma Asthma is a chronic respiratory disorder caused by inflammation and narrowing of the bronchial tubes. It is one of the most common long-term diseases in children. In this picture, this is the normal bronchial tube that is not inflamed. While this is the bronchial tube with asthma, it is swollen and narrow. Asthma is triggered by airborne substances, allergies, smoking, weather, common bacteria, and viruses. The symptoms of asthma are coughing, wheezing, chest pain, shortness of breath, and trouble sleeping. It can be prevented by avoiding the asthma triggers, getting vaccinated for influenza and pneumonia, inhalers, and nebulizers are the key components of asthma treatment. Number 2. Chronic Obstructive Pulmonary Disease COPD. Chronic Obstructive Pulmonary Disease or COPD is a chronic inflammatory lung disease that causes obstructed airflow from the lungs. It is the development of sputum that makes the infected suffer from difficulty in breathing. Sputum, also known as phlegm, is a thick type of mucus made in your lungs. Cigarette smoking is the leading cause of COPD. The other causes are empyzema and bronchitis. The symptoms are shortness of breath, wheezing, chest tightness, and cough with sputum. The best way to prevent COPD is to never start smoking. And if you smoke, just quit. The treatment are medication, lung therapy, and bronchodilators. Number 3. Chronic Bronchitis Chronic bronchitis is an inflammation of the mucous membrane that lines the bronchial tubes. In this picture, this is the healthy airway, while this is the inflamed airway. The causes of chronic bronchitis are cigarette smoking, dust, smoke from burning coal, and air pollution. The thick mucus buildup causing coughing with sputum, difficulty in breathing, wheezing, heavy feeling in the chest, and shortness of breath. Do not smoke or quit smoking to prevent chronic bronchitis. Chronic bronchitis is not curable, but there are several medications like bronchodilators and surgical procedures that can help relieve symptoms. Number 4. Empyzema Empyzema is another form of COPD that causes damage to the air sacs or alveoli in the lungs. In this picture, these are the normal alveoli, while these are the damaged alveoli. The primary cause of empyzema is 
cigarette smoking, and other causes are air pollution, chemical fumes, and dusts. Frequent coughing, wheezing, and shortness of breath are the symptoms of impaisema. To prevent impaisema, do not smoke and avoid breathing secondhand smoke. A person with impaisema could be treated using prescribed medications, lung therapy, and surgical procedures. Number 5. Lung Cancer Lung cancer occurs when abnormal cells in the lungs divide uncontrollably, causing tumors to grow. These are the tumors in the lungs. Cigarette smoking is the number one cause of lung cancer. The other causes are secondhand smoke and gene changes. The symptoms of lung cancer are a cough that does not go away, coughing of blood, shortness of breath, chest pain, headache, and hoarseness. The best way to reduce the risk of lung cancer are not to smoke and to avoid breathing in other people's smoke. The most common treatment options are surgery, chemotherapy, and radiotherapy. Number 6. Tuberculosis or TB Tuberculosis or TB is a disease caused by bacteria called Mycobacterium tuberculosis. The bacteria can spread from one person to another person through tiny droplets released into the air via coughs or sneezes. These are the slow-growing Mycobacterium tuberculosis. Tuberculosis is caused by bacteria called Mycobacterium tuberculosis. The symptoms are a cough that lasts for more than three weeks coughing up blood, chills and fever, weight loss, and chest pain. Physical distancing, good ventilation, and good hygiene are the prevention. With early detection and appropriate antibiotics, TB is treatable. Number 7. Pneumonia Pneumonia is an infection in one or both lungs which causes inflammation of the air sacs. In this picture, these are the normal alveoli, while these are the inflamed alveoli. The infection is caused by bacteria, fungi, and viruses such as SARS-CoV, MERS-CoV, and recently SARS-CoV-2. The symptoms of pneumonia are chest pain, cough with phlegm, fatigue, chills and fever, shortness of breath, nausea, and vomiting. Pneumonia can be prevented by getting vaccinated, good hygiene, and Avoiding cigarette smoking. Pneumonia can usually treatable at home with a rest, antibiotics, and lots of fluid intakes. Number 8. Coronavirus Disease or COVID-19 Coronavirus disease or COVID-19 is the new disease that comes from a type of coronavirus named SARS-CoV-2. Symptoms show up to 14 days. Some are asymptomatic that show no symptoms, but they are already infected and can spread the virus if not in isolation. These are the coronavirus. The causes are severe acute respiratory syndrome or SARS 
and coronavirus 2 or SARS-CoV-2. The most common symptoms are fever, dry cough, and tiredness. The less common symptoms are aches and pains, sore throat, diarrhea, conjunctivitis or pink eye, headache, loss of taste and smell, and rashes. The serious symptoms are difficulty in breathing, chest pain, loss of speech and movement. To prevent the spread of COVID-19, wash your hands regularly, maintain physical distancing, avoid touching your face, cover your mouth when coughing and sneezing, avoid smoking, wear face masks, stay at home, and get vaccinated for COVID-19. A person with mild symptoms of COVID-19 can recover at home with enough rests, a healthy diet, exercise, and medications.